alive, four people killed after a horrific crash in Stewart, one car bursting into flames after hitting a minivan Tuesday afternoon. Good evening, I'm Tiffany Kenny. I'm Todd McDermott. Thanks for joining us here at 5 o'clock today. We've learned one of the victims was a former school teacher. Asuji Nam joins us live in Stewart with how friends are remembering those victims. Suji. Todd, well, I'm here near the intersection of US 1 and 14th Street, and behind me you can see a growing memorial of flowers where the crash happened, where that crash took the lives of four people. Here in our school, she was one of our most popular teachers ever. Dr. Daryl Norman of First Baptist Church remembering a dear friend and former colleague, Debbie Trowbridge, who passed away alongside her husband in a tragic car accident Tuesday. Or they were celebrating their anniversary yesterday and turning into their community and then propelled out into eternity. Florida Highway Patrol said a Tesla was going southbound on US-1 towards Baker Road and a minivan that the Trow Bridges were in was going northbound making a left turn onto 14th Street. That is when the Tesla with two people inside collided with the Trow Bridges. Officials say the Tesla caught on fire. Two teenagers in the Tesla died. I've had already some contact me and say my children were in her class and uh, they loved her dearly. We learned Debbie taught at First Baptist Christian School for 13 years until 2013. Loved ones remembering a tremendous soul in the community. Wonderful teacher, wonderful Christian lady, just such a joy and inspiration to all of us. Barbara Lassiter Smith said she also worked at the school and Debbie was her son's second grade teacher. She was standing beside him and um, as he was reading what he was thankful for. My wife taught down the hallway from her, third grade, and Debbie taught the fifth. And so Debbie would always bring her, her mail outs and bulletins and things like that to Kim for her to check the spelling. And Debbie was very intelligent. Kim told me, she said, I think Debbie was actually checking my spelling. But we sure are. Um reeling in the loss of her here on earth, that is for sure. And we reached out to Florida Highway Patrol for an update into the investigation and they said there are no new details at this time. We of course will provide you the latest as we learn more. Reporting live in Martin County, I'm Sujinov for Delhi PBF 25 News.